people need to be a little more uh, like cooperative with you know like security and everything like that, maybe um, get a little more security. While this bartender says she loved working her first SantaCon in Hoboken, she doesn't want it to be the last for the Mile Square City. Hoboken police say they beefed up security in preparation for the event, but still 16 people were arrested. And Hoboken police chief Ken Ferranti was live tweeting it all. He wrote, just had a prisoner spit directly in one of our officers face during processing. In another tweet, he said, how some try to paint this as a charitable event is absolutely laughable. Last year, only five people were arrested at Hoboken SantaCon. Yesterday, five people had been arrested in just the first four hours. This man working security at Hotel Victor couldn't believe what he was seeing. Why was this year's SantaCon worse than all the others? It just seemed like a lot of aggression, like over aggression, really, pretty much. So. And what did you personally see? A lot of uh, a lot of the bar patrons that came in wanted to kind of confront the bouncers, uh, staff at the bar, like just too much aggression. Now it's fun if you uh, you know know how to control yourself and have a good time, but it was absolutely uh, complete and utter mayhem, in a fun way. A new petition is calling to stop the event going forward in Hoboken. Supporters say New York City is better equipped to handle the size of this wild and ruckus party. And the Hoboken mayor-elect, Ravi Bala, is back in Chief Ferrante to figure out the best way to handle the event once he's in office. So you don't want to see an end to SantaCon? Oh, no. No. I think it should go on. And on. But just maybe more peacefully? Yes. Definitely more peacefully. If there's um, all these arrests going on and fights and there's violence, then that's not what you know Santa Con's supposed to be about, and that's what what the um, the holiday season's supposed to be about. And according to the police chief's tweet, there were 51 summonses for public drinking, public urination, and disorderly conduct. 53 people went to local hospitals, and there were 282 calls for service from the police department. We're in Hoboken, New Jersey. McGee Hickey, PIX11 News.